Ding dong, Joffrey's dead. He's all dead. The Joffrey's dead. Ding dong, the wicked Joffrey's dead. I didn't know the words. You've never seen The Wizard of Oz? No, I haven't. Oh my word. What childhood did you have? Okay, so my childhood was at Ed and Eddie and Dexter's Laboratory and Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends. Yeah, but did you not watch like good movies? Yeah, I watched like Armageddon and Die Hard and pretty much anything that Bruce Willis was in. Because my dad loved Bruce Willis and that's what we watched, so... Haven't oh, seen good The Lion and the Witch of the Wardrobe, but always wanted to. I've never seen Star Wars. There's some bed knobs and broomsticks. Never seen Harry Potter. Nope. Harry I think Potter. my dad took me to see a Star Wars in the cinema. Like the Star Wars one with the guy with the red face. Is that okay. one? You Fell know, asleep. One of, my, <laughs> one, of my friends, one of my friends knew him. The, oh, the, guy, that, him. the guy that plays... Uh, Do you the, know who he didn't man. know though? Who? Joffrey. <laughs> Joffrey's dead, Joffrey's dead. <laughs> so we are filming this video on the same day. This is like 10 minutes after. Why am I wearing a hoodie? It's crazy. Like I went like this and it was like. Susie was clothes. like, are you going to change your t-shirt? I was like, no, I was changing my bloody t-shirt to record another video. So, like, okay, well, can you put a hoodie on? Well, actually, I said, I said, I said I was giving me a hoodie. If you wanted me to look different, that. and now you're all like breaking the fourth wall being like, we're actually recording this straight after. So why did you change your clothes? What's the point? If you what? had to fool them, I'm taking this video, I'm roasting! I'm so warm! Okay, take it off, like, don't make a drama. Oh my god, he's having a I'm BF. <laughs> I made him watch White Chicks the other day for the first time, and I'll be honest with you, that movie's kind of cringe. Like, see, when I was younger, that movie was my everything. I didn't think it was going to age well, but actually... It wasn't as bad. It wasn't as bad as I expected. No, there was a few questionable moments, but it was kind of funny, so... And the point was, it was taking the piss out of things so it was kind of it's okay if it was a bit questionable it's because okay it was, if it's a parody yeah I mean it was taking the piss out of the people right oh god I feel so much better guys this is the same day literally right get out of the board out of oh, oh. <laughs> hello hey Game of Thrones how's it going we are back it is Game of Thrones episode 3 as I say twice a week now Tuesdays and Friday, so happy Tuesday to you all. If you want to watch this with no cuts, just chill with us unedited. You can watch it on my website, suzylou.co.uk. VIP is phone 99. Really helps us out a lot. So thank you to all of you who are subscribed. We're also thinking about doing these a bit in advance. Yes. So, so VIPs can get them a bit sooner. Even earlier. That'd be nice just yeah. for helping us out. Yeah, so thank you so much. Got a wedding. Money, you cough and money just <laughs> falls out of you. You say wedding and it's like, Brah! come oh, back. No. Oh no. So that's where we're at just now. Oh my God, did you just ask for money? Yeah, give me your money, bitch. No, we did not. <laughs> give me but if you're happy just chilling on YouTube, just make sure you are here Tuesdays and Fridays, 7 p.m. UK time. And we will be here to entertain you. Right. Hey, Robbie. Yeah, get me. So the last episode, we have an EastEnders situation. Bum 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 bum. Joffrey. <laughs> Who done it? Who done it? I'm fucking roasting. I don't think it was. <laughs> I thought it was hot. It was warm in here. Really Maybe we're bloody hoodies. This is ridiculous. <laughs> I got like a big fucking jumper on. I'm like. Loki Go through a bloody energy crisis and it's like the Sahara Desert in this house. Who done it? No, he didn't. See? It was a granny that done it. Who had nothing to do with it? What if it was Sansa? So I'm just thinking of all the possible ways. Who was on that... first? What do you mean? Who was on first? Who was on what first? <laughs> no, I don't think who was on what. I don't, I don't think what would be very happy about that. You're so confused. Who was on first? Who was on what? <laughs> no, who was not on what? I, what was on third? What? What? Are, you're really confusing me. You're <laughs> freaking me out. <laughs> you're doing this on purpose. I showed you that skit. Oh, so it was a skit. So you were confusing me. No, it's a skit. I was. I was referencing. Oh, whatever. Right. Let's do it. Do it. <laughs> Delving. Meme review. No. Oh. Okay. So. 
Aww. You got a dirty glass? Well, yeah, it's my lipstick. Oh. Don't touch it. Well, wait a minute. In the but glass. every time I take a sip out of this, right, it makes this really... Did you not notice me a minute ago? I took a sip and I went like this. Because <laughs> <laughs> I, take, I, a drink, like, I take a drink of it. It's Coke Zero because sugar and skinny is it bitches. Zero? It is Coke Zero. You picked not, it up. Is it not Pepsi Max? No, you picked up. It's oh, and Greg's. When we went to Greg's yesterday. But it was like a cheeky wee sausage and roll. Got you a know. steak bake. And... Take a drink out of that and listen to it. <laughs> <laughs> you hear that? It's, it's, the, it's the ocean. It just makes me think like... What, 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 what am I supposed to be hearing? It, it, it sounds like just it goes proper acidy and all I can think is... What acidy? Like, <laughs> what am I putting in my system, you know? Well, it's just the carbonation. It's just going... Kind of, it's really loud. It's <laughs> So you're telling me that you've never taken a drink and gone, ooh. No. Maybe when I was like four. (laughs) (laughs) Well, I didn't get these drinks when I was like four. So some of us were still on milk at that age. We had a soda stream back in the day. Don't soda stream milk. Oh, it dripped all over me. I got a wet leg. It made me ink. It made me ink. Right, so I'm quite excited for this episode, hence oh, why we're watching it know, one after the other. You know we won't find out in this episode. That's not what I'm saying though, but we're going to find out like the whodunits. It's going to just carry on. And did Shay make it out alive? Find out now. <laughs> in this episode of Game of Thrones. And see if we find in out in this episode. <laughs> like, She's seen this before. <laughs> <laughs> hey! <laughs> okay, that one topped it out. Oh, sorry. sorry, Mike. Sorry, headphone users. We'll turn it down, don't we? No, I won't. Where's Sansa? Find her. Bar the gates of the city sees every ship in the harbour. Are they this stupid, though? Do you think that he would do it right in front of you like that? I know, it was obviously... A, it's a obviously not Tyrion, and it's obviously not Sansa. No. Yo, she's like the Scottish Widow's advert. I was gonna say that. How does she run forward though when the wind's blowing her and it stayed perfectly on? It's, it's like glued to Sell the top it. of her head. Sell it. Take her down to where they train with Jamie. No one goes down there. Where are they? Oh, he's got me robot. Oh. Yeah. So what was planned? My dude. Somewhere safe. Leave. Leave. You don't owe Titty in anything. I well liked done, him. I like Tyrion, but she doesn't owe him anything. Let's go! Fire the cannons! <laughs> <laughs> Good for her. As long as this guy's not an actual pirate or something. Nah, he saved her life. Again. Sh- she saved his life, sorry. Well, he never saved her. He was the one that was following her that she was creeped out by. Well, I mean, sometimes those are good people to have in your life. So whose ship is this? Do you believe in ghost stories, Sansa? Well, well you, you should. should. Cause yeah, you're yeah. in one. You'll be fine. I love those movies. Stronger than you know. Is he gonna go back to the village? Do you think? <laughs> the village. What? You know, no. You know the biggest city in the entire place. It's a village. <laughs> Anything that has chickens is a village. <laughs> <laughs> Who is it? No, that's not good though. But it is good because I should get back before someone thinks to look for me. First, you want your pay. Ten thousand? Was it? Ten thousand. Oof. He's gonna kill him, isn't he? No, don't. (gasps) Yeah. Wait. No, no! You're such a good guy. A thousand gold cloaks are searching for you, (laughs) and if they found you. How do you think they would punish the girl who murdered the king? I didn't murder anyone. But that's what they think. The king who executed your father, who tormented you for years, and you fled the scene of his murder. Even if you stayed to the blame chair. Because he was a drunk and a fool, and I don't trust drunk fools. But he got Sansa to you, so... Yeah, but you knew he would have freaking blabbed. Whose fucking side are you on, man? Money buys a man's silence for a time. A bolt in the heart buys it forever. I'll remember that then, just in case I need to use that. And he gave you a priceless necklace that once belonged to his grandmother. 
The last legacy of House Hollard. Was that a lie? Yeah. I had it made a few weeks ago. What did I want to tell you about the capital? We're all liars here. Well, I mean, that kind of means that he's a liar too. We can't really trust Little Willie. <laughs> little Willie. I promise you that. I, I, I'm Safe bullish on this one. Me. Sailing home. Why do you gotta get in her face like that though? Because he's, he's like my brothers. <laughs> I was gonna say, he's just like your <laughs> brothers when they're drunk. No sense of personal space. Clawing at his own throat, looking to his mother to make it stop. It was horrible. The world is overflowing with horrible things. But they're all a tray of cakes next to death. <laughs> they brought me your grandfather's body when he died, you know. Made me look at it. What was it like? Dead. <laughs> a dead body. The man I'd married and suffered to father my children. A great doughy lump I'd sat next to it. Endless dinners and tedious gatherings. There he was. Lying on a table. Well, honey, I hate to tell you this. That's kind of where we all end up, though, isn't it? I ain't lying on no tables. <laughs> I must be cursed. Nonsense. Your circumstances have improved markedly. <laughs> you true. may not have enjoyed watching him die, but you enjoyed it more than you would have enjoyed being married to him. I can promise you that. Oh, Granny! Our alliance with the Lannisters remains every bit as necessary to them as it is unpleasant for us. You did wonderful work on Joffrey. The next one should be easier. <laughs> See what I mean though? She's acting like someone that's just like, oh, do you know what? I wasn't really happy with you Maddie, and Joffrey, so I've put an end to that. Yeah, but The next one will be better. She should have done it to him after. Yeah, the, the timing was awful. Yeah, after the consummation. It means I'll become king. Yes, you will become king. Good! He looks just like Joffrey though. This isn't good. He's a nice old lad. For now. A good king? Hmm. I think so as well. You've got the right temperament for it. Oh, was it Tywin? Baelor the Blessed was holy. And pious. He built this sept. That's cool. Good job, he also Baylor. named a six-year-old boy High Septon because he thought the boy could work miracles. Not a good job. He ended up fasting himself into an early grave because food was of this world and this world was sinful. <laughs> so not the most intelligent just, then, bless him. Yeah. Next start was just. just. Oris the first was just. She said though that Joffrey did so much damage. And now he's dead. Mm. I wanted to see him suffer. Was that truly just of him? To abandon his subjects to an evil that he was too gullible to recognize? No. No. Well, that just means he wasn't very just. Strength. King Robert was strong. He was. He won the rebellion and crushed the Targaryen dynasty. I love this because... He's going through all the people with the strengths and this and that. And I feel like he's going to get to Joffrey and going to be like, he had nothing. So, we have a man who starves himself to death. A man who lets his own brother murder him. And a man who thinks that winning and ruling are the same thing. What do they all lack? Compassion. Balls. Wisdom. Yes. Brains. Ah. How do you know which choice is wise and which isn't? You, any experience of treasuries and granaries or shipyards and soldiers? No, of course not. A wise king knows what he knows and what he doesn't. Yeah, and Joffrey thought he knew absolutely everything. A wise young king yep. listens to his counselors and heeds their advice until he comes of age. This is, yeah. Your brother was not a wise king. Your brother was not a good king. If he had been, perhaps he'd still be alive. <laughs> now, as the king, you will have to marry. She oh. hates it. She's just like, wait, what, what, what? We can't move on this fast. That was Tywin. I'm kind of with you on this one. Tywin was basically like, oh, this kid ain't listening to me. Let's get the next one. Yeah. And he's young enough that he can mold, mold him. On. Yep. I'm all right. You are. You will be. I'll see to that. 
You know, you can't fuck him as well, Jamie. <laughs> Let me fuck the one. I'll give it a bloody good try. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All of you. Oh, I, I, I want to walk in a room just once and be like, all of you. Leave. For I may have sex with my sister with dead <laughs> over, <laughs> over my child's body. <laughs> so does that mean the other boy is also Jamie's then? Probably, aye. Yeah. Because they all, they all look the same. I feel like that came out bad. But you know what I mean. It was Tyrion. He killed him. How can you just listen to what your dad says and not put two and two together there? The day will come when you think you are safe and happy. And your joy will turn to ashes in your mouth. Were you really happy though? With all of that shit going on? Stupid bitch. Offend him. No. Offend your son. <sighs> Kill Tyrion. Jimmy likes Tyrion. There'll be a trial. We'll get to the truth of what happened. Don't want to try. He'll squirm his way to freedom, given the chance. I want him dead. That's the problem. When a lady gets it in her mind, there is no twisting. She's not bloody twist. Oh, baby boy. He was such a good boy. I he know. loved all the common people. He fed the poor. He painted the town sometimes. He was a good boy. You totally didn't torture small animals for joy. Oh, Christ. It's disgusting. It's always good to know that they're just actors, because that's the only thing that gets me through. <laughs> Told you we're going to shag over his dead body. We might do. We can always make another one. What is that, though? With a hateful her? woman. Oh. Why have the gods made me love a hateful woman? I don't know. This is really <laughs> your fucking body! <laughs> I was joking. What are you, what are you doing? Wait, this, this is weird. Well, when one dies, you have make the ability one. to make another one. It's like bears. Just like bears. I think this is really happening, babe. See if she gets pregnant now, though. She's got no husband. It's not right. It's not right. It's not right. This is the first time I've agreed with her. <laughs> I don't care. Well, I, I was mean, kidding when I said that we're gonna fuck over his dead body. I think I said it too, and I was also joking. Oh look, Where it's are we? Well, thank God, something normal. Near fair market, I think. You think? You don't have a map. There's no I GPS to that. Look at what out his Garmin. How far is it to the Erie? Far. And you're sure we're going the right way? Leave me go. I want you there as soon as I can. Get my gold. Be in my way. On your way where? Where do you care? <laughs> She's like me, like, I'm just making conversation. Like, don't you be rude to me. I actually quite like some. Fighters are self sword. Second sons could be. Seems like a good fit for me. I'd like to see Bravos one day. Second sons are those that fight for. I have friends the there. <laughs> oh, oh, I was not ready for that. That was a big one. What do you want? What do I want? This is my land. If I'm standing on it, it's my land. <laughs> Which house did he fight for? Starks. The Tully's of River Run. Oh. There's a storm coming. You'll be wanting a roof tonight. There's fresh air in the barn. And Sally here makes rabbit stew just like her mum used to do. Oh, I lost his mother. We don't have much, but any man that bled for House Tully is welcome to it. That means you'd be on your bloody best behaviour there, Hound. We ask the father to judge us with mercy. That is all too nice. Someone's dying. <laughs> we ask the warrior to give us courage in these days of strife and turmoil. We ask the maiden to protect Sally's virtue and keep her from the clutches of depravity. You're going to do all seven of the fuckers? <laughs> <laughs> she did say he wasn't like before. Please excuse we him. Ask the Smith to strengthen our hands and our backs so we may finish the work required of us. Don't. Ask the crone to guide us on our journey from darkness to darkness. And we ask the stranger not to kill us in our beds tonight for no damn reason at all. <laughs> I'm so sorry, but I'm also going to behave just like him. I'm also starving. Ooh. 
The fucking slurp sound is doing me in. It's like some freaking Twitch stream. <laughs> Did you fight at the twins? Or rather fight? Eat your heart out, man. more like the Red Wedding, they're calling it. Order Frey committed sacrilege that day. Yes, he did. The gods will have their vengeance. Frey will burn in the seventh hell for what he did. Let's hope. I was going to send Sally north to stay with my brother, but the north's no better. The whole country's gone sour. You got any ale? Oh, for God's sakes. Afraid not. Sometimes you just need a good solid cold one, you know? You look like you could really swing that sword. A real warrior. Proper training. Those raiders wouldn't stand a chance against you. Oh, well, he's gonna ask him to stay. I could use a man to help with the farm work. Sally does what she can, but she can't lift a bale of hay. Oh. And if any thieves came looking for easy pickings, one look at you, I bet they'd run the other way. Meaning no offense. He's a nice man. That's a shame, but the hound already has his own shit going on. I know. What do you pay? I don't have much. But I have hidden a bit of silver from the bandits. Don't steal. Don't steal. Don't. He's not a thief. He says that he's not a thief. Fair wages for fair work. Excuse me? Okay, one minute. You're on the way, wanting to fight everyone. And now you're going to stay? I don't. Chickens! It's like the best. Going to sleep with the chickens. Oh, what are you doing, Hound? For fuck's sake. I thought you weren't a thief. No, you did not. No, he did. He did. Yeah, he did. He fed us! Aye, he took us in. He's a good man. His daughter makes a nice stew. And they'll both be dead come winter. You don't know that! I do know it! He's weak. He can't protect himself. Well, not against someone like you, obviously. <laughs> I don't. You're the worst shit in the Seven Kingdoms! Plenty worse than me. I just understand the way things are. How many stars they got to be ahead before you figure it out? Oh, he is right though. She's like I feel like if that was him. his brother, he would have just chopped the guy's head off. Well, to be fair, if it wasn't for Arya, I would have just killed him then and there anyway. Oh, like. When have you even got the food? There he is, Sam the Slayer. Don't Sam the Slayer. Anymore. She's not a whore. No, maybe I'll give her a copper tonight and find out. <laughs> Uh, okay. Sam's gonna kill him. <laughs> you all think I'm lying? About what? Killing the White Walker. You're not lying. <laughs> I'll never forget the way it screamed. Oh. Well, Sam. But you're the only one that saw it. And they all think you're just a... A what? Well, a... A wildling. <laughs> oh, honestly. A lady of the night. It's not a very nice word, I suppose. I don't know. Makes me sound a bit dangerous, doesn't it? <laughs> well, I mean, you can take whatever you want from it, I suppose. Goose? I was gonna say, what animal is that? Because I almost don't want to know. Goose fromage. <laughs> Are you all right? Uh, no one bothering you? I get a lot of looks. I hear them making their jokes, but no one's touched me, if that's what you mean. Oh, that's good. I worry about it sometimes. Well, they're not allowed to there, though. That's ah, the thing. yes, yes. Well, I'm just saying they should stick to the rules. One hundred men, one woman. They've got other things to think oh. about. Ah, uh, <laughs> after watching Chainsaw Man. <laughs> There's a hundred men lying awake at night picturing you. And what about you? He's part of the hundred, isn't he? What about me? Gilly? She's only got eyes for you, Samuel. Answer the question! I worry about you. Oh, he's the real man! Oh, she likes him. How can for you? For worrying about me. This is true love right here. Just wait till they kiss. They're my brothers, but some of them were thieves before they came here. Some, some of them, them were, were rapists. rapists. You saw what they did at your father's keep. So, what are you saying? He's just scared for you. Maybe right, you'd be safer in Molestown. Oh. Are you bored of me? 
Oh, bored of you. No. But they can't be together because it's not safe for her there. I want to protect you. <laughs> oh, Sam. I'll get these to Hob. Keep an eye on little Sam. Oh, why is she like this? Keep an eye on the baby. I was gonna say, I love that she just left the kid there. Well, she says keep an eye on little Sam. She wasn't talking about his penis. <laughs> he is so small though. But it's definitely not the place for a baby. That's not for quite, sure. No. Like, God, no. Your grace? You're a literary man now. What do you make of that? I mean, you could just ask him to read it. That'd be rude. I like that he reads while moving his mouth. My dad does that. I said those words when I tossed a leech into the fire. A leech filled with bastard blood. A bastard you set free. I am now faced with a great opportunity and I am powerless to take advantage of it. We'll find you an army of grace. I've been working day and night. What progress have you made? Don't even think for a second that because you threw a fucking leech anywhere that this is your doing. I know. Taking it away from who actually did it. Hey. Hey. They don't have enough men between them to raid a pantry. <laughs> don't know, is it Tomb Raider's pantry? 10,000 skilled soldiers fight for the Golden Company. The Golden Company? They've never broken a contract. They're cell swords! We're willing to use blood magic to put you on the throne, but we're not willing to pay men to fight. Ah! Visions and prophecies may be too, but I've never heard of visions and prophecies winning a war. Soldiers win wars. Soldiers on the ground. It's dirty on the ground. We don't have any gold. Not yet. <laughs> We could dig a gold. Go digging. Gold if I rush. My claim, my claim will be forgotten. No gadge, no glory. Someone else's history book. That was a trophy in a game I played recently. I'm running out of time, Sir Davos. Which means you're running out of time. No. You leave him alone. Take him out. Him. Gonna deal with me. I like on your night. I thought you weren't coming. The hand of the king doesn't have much leisure time. You won't be a very good hand if you see the word knight and say Kurt Niggins. That happened once. <laughs> <laughs> Can't say that word to get cancelled on Twitter. <laughs> it's a new one today. Lots of tricky words. But I think you can manage. You'll never read well if you move your lips. That's how children do it. See? Aww. <laughs> talking about my dad like that. <laughs> the life and adventures of Elio Grivas, first sword of Bravos. Thank you very much. <laughs> like you know? I tried to explain to him the difference between pirates and smugglers, but he didn't seem any more interested in the distinction than your father. I suppose if you work for the Iron Bank of Bravos, and each one of your gold barges is worth half a kingdom, you tend not to be overly concerned with the kind of distinction. No. Kill first, ask questions later. Oh no, he's going to rob one of the... Oh, from everything I've heard about this iron bank, you don't want to be robbing them. Well, when you gotta get gold... Rob a bank. Listen, I played enough GTA to know where this is going. It's gonna be a heist. You should write it yourself. It's good practice. It's too important for me. I need a smart person to do it. Oh. To the officers of the iron bank of Bravos. I'm robbing you. Baratheon, the one true king of Westeros. But that's not you. I need to get their attention. Go. <laughs> right. Is he allowed to do that? Well. Well, he is the right hand man, so I guess he could be writing things on his behalf. I wonder if he's going to tell Stannis, though. Or no. if he's just going to. No, 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 no. It's like they're all in the Night's Watch, and then Sam's just living his best life. I was like, going to say, he's life. just doing whatever the fuck. Oh, tits. He's just going to do whatever the fuck he likes. As you say, it's like just taking his actual wife around the place, like, this is where we eat our dinner and... What's his name? Sam. Oh, lovely. Uh, daddy? No. Where's daddy? He's dead. Oh. I don't like you. She looks like she's coming onto it or wanting to eat the child. I'm not sure which one. But both. You're fucking rolling. <laughs> Only room and board. That's right. She'll clean and cook and look after the other girl's baby. I'm like, can you fuck off? <laughs> She's so no, weird. There'd be money. Give you a piece of it. No other work. Good for you, Sam. I don't think I would trust 
anyone. <laughs> there. No, I wouldn't be happy even putting her there. She's got a baby. She's got a baby. I think there's a few of the other women that have got babies as well, though. What was he doing just then? Oh, it looked like he was cleaning out a condom. That's what I thought it was doing as well. I promise to come back and visit whenever Why? I can. That's her bed. Bro. Bruh. You're protecting me north of the wall. This is different. They're brothers of the Night's Watch and I can't just stab them in the back. And I can't run away, which is what we did at Craster's. You have to trust me. You're literally putting her in like a whorehouse. I know. With a baby. A baby. Best for you. Oh, Gilly. This devil isn't the best for her. Please don't. Even little Sam doesn't like it. Sam, you're making the wrong decision. Sam. It's just going to like cry all the time and then it's going to be in danger because everyone's going to get pissed off with it. Or pissed off with Sam, shall we say. Oh, who do you think it is? I'm going to say Oberon. <sighs> oh no. Oh, it's Oberon's missus. <laughs> to be honest, I was just like, I can't see anything. Is that Jamie? <laughs> <laughs> no. I'm greedy. At least he finally got his time in the whorehouse. It's going to say that's all he ever seems to want to do though, isn't it? No, he wanted that guy, do you remember? Mm -hmm. You're lovely, I just never acquired the taste. You're calling my beauty an acquired taste. Uh-oh. That's quite all right, lover. There's more for you. He's like, fucking dick. I'm sorry, what is an acquired taste about her? I mean, obviously he's gay. That's the point. But still, she's beautiful. When it comes to war, I fight for Dawn. When it comes to love, I don't choose sides. I hope I have as much stamina when I'm your age. What are you? What? 25. <sighs> Children. That's definitely not a thing that you say to like anyone. <laughs> that pretty ass of yours will sag, your belly will grow soft, and your back will ache in the night, and grey hairs will sprout from your ears. Great, sand and all just sounds magnificent. Magnificent. Is that the word? Magnificent. What the hell, woman? Oh, I was thinking of maleficent. It also sounds maleficent. Girls and boys will line up to fuck him till the day he dies. They will I mean, he's like, have to line up behind you. Come on, he's like he's the second prince. Oh, uh oh. Prince Oberyn. Lord Tywin. May we have the room? I mean, you can't honestly think that they're suspects in anything, really. But if it is him that's done it, he's just gonna throw it back on everyone. Poor Oberon's just like, he never gets to have his nah. day at the whorehouse, does he? Bullshit. Yeah. Would you like to sit? Ha! <laughs> no, thank you. On that bed? <laughs> Some wine? No. No, I think we're all uh, a bit terrified of wine at this point. I don't believe that a child is responsible for the sins of his father. He is responsible for the sins of himself, though. The king was poisoned. Well, it's clearly poisoned. I hear you studied poisons at the Citadel. I did. This is why I know. Your hatred for my family is rather well known. Okay, but so is everyone else's hatred for your family. I am a man of reason. If I cut your throat today, I will be drawn and quartered tomorrow. Men at war commit all kinds of crimes without their superior's knowledge. So you deny involvement in Elias murder? Categorically. Oh, mm -hmm. God. <laughs> mm hmm. Do you deny any involvement in Jeffers' murder? I know no one's going to ever ask him, are they? There will be a trial for my son. And as custom dictates, three judges will render a verdict. I will preside. Mace Tyrell will serve as the second judge. I would like you to be the third. Wow, okay. At least if he's there on the judging side, it's a bit more fair, hopefully. Mm -hmm. I would also invite you to sit on the small council to serve as one of the new king's principal advisors. What? Keep your enemies closer, baby. Oh no. The king is dead. The Greyjoys are in open rebellion. A wildling army marches on the wall. And in the east, a Targaryen girl has three dragons. Oh yeah, she does, baby. Yeah, boy. Only the Dornish managed to resist Aegon Targaryen and his dragons. You're saying you need us. That must be hard for you to admit. <laughs> we need each other. He's like, no, I don't think I need you. He didn't need him before this. I will help nope. you serve justice to Elias. She 
shaking the hand of the devil. So you make a deal with the devil. Oh, Tyrion. They just want rid of Tyrion. He's a good scapegoat, isn't he? Yeah, especially if it was the dad who did it. Tywin. I always forget his name. Noble effort. Oh. I didn't find the candles, though. A quill, some parchment, duck sausage, almonds, and some hard cheese. Did they oh. even look then? <laughs> they didn't see all that? Any word of Shay? I've heard nothing, my lord. I suppose that's a good thing. You're a good lad, Podrick. You're to stand trial in a fortnight for murdering the king. Do you believe I murdered Joffrey? No, my lord. Should be used to this by now, Tyrion. I would like to think, if I were arranging a royal assassination, I'd plan it in such a way that I wouldn't be standing there gawking like a fool when the king died. Yeah, exactly. Well, that's it. I mean, he was freaking out, like many other people. Have they announced the judges yet? Sits on all the food. <laughs> I'm, the sausage. I'm supposed to get a list of names from you, my lord. Anyone who might testify on your behalf. Oh, I can call my own witnesses. <laughs> I'm generous of them. Cersei, Jamie. No? She's gone. Gone. No one's seen her since the wedding. She escaped. N no one had more cause to kill Joffrey than Sansa. But the girl's no assassin. No. Whoever killed the king wanted me to lose my head for it. And with my wife's disappearance, it makes me seem that much more guilty. But the old woman could have been working with Sansa. The old woman could have put it in Sansa's head to do it. No. But, well, who poured, who poured the wine again? It was on Sansa's side. And also Sansa she picked the, up the cup. Uh, yeah. to me, I assume it's my sister that had a hand in it. But say what you will of Cersei. She loves her children. See? She is the only one I'm certain had nothing to do with this murder. Oh, That's your downfall, it was Cersei. Fetch Bronn, I have a job for him. I've already asked, my lord, they won't let him see you. Why not? They say he's a known cutthroat and your close associate. He's under investigation himself. My oh, brother. Bronn. Will they at least allow me to see Jamie? I'll ask, my lord. Jamie? Jamie's got your back too. No, he doesn't. Yes, he does. No, he doesn't. Yes, he does. He just raped his sister because he's all like, this is so hot. Yeah, I love a vicious woman. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> don't know what this was all about. Sorry, guys. <laughs> said I'd be named Sir Podrick Payne if I told the judges you'd bought a poison called the Strangler. Sir Podrick Payne? That's a nice ring to it. What did you tell him? I didn't tell them anything, my lord. Are you going to accept their offer? No. Testifying against me wasn't a suggestion. If they can't tempt you with honey, they'll choose something less sweet. You've oh. been good to me, my lord. Pod. The trial's in a fortnight. You'll want an answer before that. Already gave them an answer, my lord. Don't be stupid, Bob. No, he said no. He wouldn't do this to Tyrion. If I have to take that long walk to the executioner's block, I don't want to see your head already mounted. My lord. Lord, oh. I am giving you an order. Go and find my brother and tell him I need him. And get yourself out of King's Landing before it's too late. Oh. Lord. This is farewell. Wait, he never said, though. He never said if he didn't. He's gonna testify against him. No, he's gonna he's gonna have to leave because he's already told them he wouldn't. There has never lived a more loyal squire. <laughs> One of the real ones, Podrick. Peace, man. Look after that penis. Do you not think that Podrick looks like the blacksmith? Yes, a hundred percent. Blacksmith has a bit of a harsher face. The other guy's quite sweet looking. Mm. What's she got boiling? No, wait, wait, let me guess. Potatoes. potatoes. Well, no one boils a potato better than your mum. She got. <gasps> <laughs> oh, come on! What the hell? Hide. Hide. Well, she's just totally gone down in my estimation. Ooh. it very hard to uh, forgive her for that. Plus she is going around with cannibals. Not much of a choice though, let's be honest. You're just, you're, you're literally just murdering farmers at this point. Yeah, like you always have a choice. I'm sorry but you do. Maybe she doesn't so much because she's a woman but she's a chicken, chicken. go chicken! Save the chicken. 
You're the one that just killed his family. He's gonna fuck you up. No, I don't think he's gonna do nothing. You really gonna kill a kid, huh? You know how to get to Castle Black? <laughs> You're my Garmin. <laughs> You're my Google Maps kid. Oh my oh. lord. I'm going to eat them. Ah! Do you hear me? I'm going to eat your dead mama. And I'm going to eat your dead papa. Go this is not going to waste. At Castle Black. Why'd you let him go, huh? To go and tell the crows at Castle Black. Mm, I don't think he's going to make it, to be fair. No, I agree. See? Three dozen bodies with slit throats tossed off the top of the wall. Well, I've been wrong before, so there you go. They want to draw us out. Yeah. Take us off a few at a time. We have just over a hundred men. And that's including stewards and builders and me. You can't afford to lose a single man. Why would you go anyway? It's literally the boys come to you. Everyone else is dead. So there's no point going. Yeah. Let them do whatever the fuck. Let it be someone else's problem. You're a champion of the common people, Lord Snow. What do you say to Brother Pip's proposition? He's going to say a go. We need to shore up Castle Black. And we need to defend the wall. Yep, that's your job. That is our job. But they're undermanned, though. Well, they're, they're not going to go out into the field, are they? Range is returning. Well, I hope then... it snows soon. I want to play in the snow. But I literally said that in my last God of War video. Thought you'd have blue eyes by now. Oh. Well, at least there's more people to fight for them. Yeah, I got to held up by what? Chains. We were guests of the mutineers across this keep. Oh. Carl's running things now. He's the one put a knife through Craster's mouth. We need to ride north and kill them all. We just went over this bar. Justice can wait. It's not about justice. I told the wildlings we had over a thousand men at Castle Black alone. If they find them, they'll tell them. Carl and the others know the truth as well as we do. How long do you think they'll keep that information to themselves when the wildlings are peeling their fingernails off? Oh, Jon Snow! He just doesn't know it yet. But as soon as he gets his hands on them, he will. He'll just roll his over. And even if every one of us kills a hundred wildlings, there's still not a thing we can do to stop them. There's too many. Ah, yeah. Too many. <laughs> You need Daenerys to pop round and give you a wee hand. I know, get the fucking dragons on the go. I want to be the fucking army of Unsullied. True. I just want to be where she is. It's always sunny. It's like, and then you go Pyramids. to Jon Snow and it's like... <laughs> Although, when you're cold, you can always put on more layers. But when you're too warm, there's always so much you can take off. You take off your skin. Well, they don't mind walking around naked, do they? Get sand bloody everywhere. Only if you sit on the ground. Oh no. Getting dust up your butt. How much further is that gonna get taken, huh? Well. <laughs> How beautiful is that though, eh? We need statues like that at the front of our house. We've got a Winnie statue. <laughs> a single rider. A champion of Marine. They want you to send your own champion against them. I would send Chadley. I was gonna say Giga Chad. Chadley the second. Is that long hair or is that no, it's part of his part of his helmet? It's he's, probably horse hair. Oh, he's gonna go maybe. What do you think? Um, I would send either Chadley or Grey Worm. Maninihi. What is he doing? I believe he means to get his dick out. <laughs> At this point, she's like, I'm so fucking done with men. Like, ugh. He claims you are no woman at all, but a man who hides his cock in his own asshole. <laughs> your grace. These are meaningless words. Not meaningless if half the city you intend to take is listening to them. I mean, look so at the size of our army, though. First, I will need this one to be quiet. Do I have a champion? Inte Bakis are 
Yes. yes. Oh, amazing. yes, my dude. Now, nah, Giga Chat is going to be like, no, me, me, me. Oh, no, but it's so, so telling. I've been by your side longer than any of them, Khaleesi. Let me stand for you today as well. Do it, Batman! My most trusted advisor. I know you love everyone, but you have to pick someone. It's got to be Chadley. She doesn't really give a fuck about him. I'm not your general or a member of your Queen's Guard or the commander of your unsullied. My mother was a whore. It's not very nice. It's your mother. Let me kill this man for you. Very well. We have quite an audience. Chadley, a second! Make it worth their while. I know, and dye your beard while you're at it and have a golden He's moustache. He's brave, your grace. Yes. Win or lose, as long as the whole city's watching. Right, come on, Chadley. There's no way they just changed the actor for him to die now. Okay. <laughs> Wait, you gonna joust? Nah. No. You sure you don't want a horse? I would want a horse. Oh my god, it's Elden Ring all over again. <laughs> Horses are dumber than men. So very nice. I've met some pretty smart horses and some pretty fucking dumb men. Isn't that what you just said? Horses it's... are dumber than men. Yes, but I've met some pretty smart horses and some pretty dumb fucking men. Oh. Come on, Chadley. Oh. It's not funny, man. I need to explain Ooh, the joke. Oh, the winky wink. She does like him. It's that one fucking hit. He's not even got his arms up or anything. Oh, he's just going to chop his penis off. <laughs> okay, okay, here we go. Oh, it's, oh, it's Kitana. What do you mean? It's a wee dagger. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the human! Oh! 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 was easy. Oh, she's like, I just got wet suddenly. <laughs> oh, come on, that's cheating! Oh, they haven't got good aim yet. Is he peeing? Yeah. <laughs> Drag about that. <laughs> Face Bob. Construis Jevia Ixa in Obi Petra Gemo Vestretis, Yedauri Gemo Vestretis. I doubt they've told their slaves anything. Young guy to Hetrosa, Sirino in Cotiorzi. Diary. Uh oh. Cecil Merin not mustan. She's had it a bit too easy, though, I think. Do you not? Well, when you can turn the slaves against them. All the guys are looking like, oh shit, this isn't good. Yep. Uh oh. She's been quite good with not killing innocents, so hopefully this is accurate. Turns out she's just launching like wire cutters. Oh. Whoa, watch your head. I mean, she can't guarantee that she's not going to get any innocence with this. Wait, right? what is she launching? I Battles? Thought they, I thought they were like... Oh, is it all the, 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 the chains? Ah, this is all the chains. Ah, that's really clever. That is really clever. Wire cutters would be more useful though. That's really clever. You want to get that off? Yeah, you like the look of this? Push him over the edge. Crack on, chop chop. Well, that's it. There's more slaves than there is of the bad guys. And that's what's just been happening. Every second Wait, she's what? like, no! I was like, what? I want another what? Emidor! I want another I want Bullshit. I was enjoying that. I was enjoying that. Yeah, okay. Although, well, have you heard my stomach rumbling for I know, the past half an hour? Constant. I need a cheese toasty, man. I'm Yo! starving. Yo! Toasty! 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 Oh, it's like little cheese, okay? It's not toasty. It's different. Okay, well, I different. want one. The Americans will have you. I want one. Okay. Okay, we'll have one after Girl cheese this. time. That was a good episode, and I'm, I'm just like sat here like, okay, okay, like... Next! Here's phone in you. Suspected spam. Ah, at this time of night? I know. Well, it would have to be. It's bloody nine o'clock, man. Bloody nine o'clock, Bloody nine this. o'clock, man. That was a good episode. Oof. I really, really enjoyed that. It yes. was a bit more um, relaxed, shall we say, after the last episode. Yeah, no, good though. It's good though. It's good though. That's it. That's all you've got to say. Yeah, it's good though. I feel like your energy is just depleted now. No.
No. No. No. no. So, I forgot what I was going to say. Oh. <laughs> that was good. Freaking Daenerys, another place. Jobs are good. Definitely think that Daenerys is growing on me. I know I've, I'm not a Daenerys hater at all. Um, but it just, it took me a little bit more time to kind of see what she was doing. And, I mean, obviously she's always had the right intentions. She has freed so many people. She's like that girl that you need to fuck up all the people at the top so that the little people can actually get paid a decent wage. <laughs> she is, though. She is, though. She's the one that's going for all the people at the top. She's unionizing the slaves. That's yeah. what she's doing. So that they can actually have a good life. Good for you. Break those chains. Break those chains. Yeah, girl. So, yeah, totally kind of Team Daenerys now. And I like her dragons. I want her dragons. Yeah. Yeah, so, so talk about the, the golden moustache. I told you this. Mm-hmm. Someone in the, the comment section was saying about how Chadley in the books didn't actually look like Chadley. And even new Chadley, Chadley II, didn't look like Chadley. He's supposed to have a purple beard and a golden moustache. And now he's just genetic hot guy. It's an attractive man. Yeah. Hmm. I preferred the first one though. Why? Because it was different. Because it was a bit different. Well, I mean, we. Uh, I forget the word I'm looking for. We gave him a thing. Yeah, he had a thing. Because he had a I love that thing was the word. Job, <laughs> thing man. was the word you were looking for. He was <laughs> chiseled. I bet he's the kind of guy that even if he was obese, he'd still have that jaw. He would be yeah. chiseled. He'd just have a second one, a bit lower. Just boom! I was like, what a dude, man. He is that guy. And they got rid of him. Got rid of Chadley. Like, what the fuck? Chadley the second. We'll just get a, let's say he's a faceless man. We'll just get a Chadley the third. Yeah. And it'll be, this is that love, potential love interest. I think that it, it is I'm surprised of... Daenerys isn't like, did you do something with your hair? <laughs> no, your face is more round than before. Yeah, I think it's because they're going to gear him up to be her love interest. And maybe they just didn't think that the other guy, was hot enough. Giga Chad, was the right fit for her. Yeah. He Possibly. was a good looking man, but he's not as good looking as the new guy. True. So. That's because a beard makes every man better looking. Yeah, but when you've got a sick ass jaw, it doesn't matter. But I see if he had a sick ass jaw and a beard. <laughs> oh man, oh. maybe Giga oh. Chad times two oh. up in here. Man. So, it was Tyrell, wasn't it? Ty- Granny Tyrell. Granny? What? Granddad. What's the guy called again? <laughs> Tywin. Tywin. Tyrant. Tywin. Tywin. So if I because he's a remember, winner. if I remember Resident Evil, I'll get it right every time. It's yeah, Tyrant. just call him Tyrant. Yeah. Right, we'll call him Tyrant. Yeah, he's a Tie fighter who always wins. He is going to try his heart, but again, is that too obvious? I don't know. Don't know. Who done it? It was Phil Mitchell. It was Jamie. It's Jamie Phil Mitchell. put Bran out the window. And now he's come back and been like, I just, I feel like you're I in the way of me and Cersei. So I would I'm like to make another one next to her, your dead body. Sure. Yeah. Was that the last episode? Uh, I. What the about this episode? That was this episode. Oh, I can't remember. It was this episode because he was lying there dead. He died. Oh yeah, he died at the end of the last yeah. episode. That episode was quite long. It was as long as they usually are. Didn't feel like it needed. It didn't feel like it was as long as that. It needed more. Needed more. Needs, so. needs more episode. That's all I can say. More episode. Well, thank you so much as always for watching us react to some Game of Thrones, and we'll catch you Friday seven p.m. See you there. What well, if they're watching this in the future? Then we could be catching them like in five seconds. Like Netflix style.